hello guys welcome back to my channel today we about study about salts a salt is a compound formed by the neutralization of an acid with a base a large variety of compounds exist as salts sodium chloride is a common salt which we used in our food some common salts and their formula are given in table 6.4 and shown in figure 6.7 here is we have sodium chloride iron chloride cobalt nitrate nickel sulfate and copper sulfate sodium chloride is sodium nitrate potassium chloride potassium nitrate ammonium chloride ammonium nitrate calcium chloride calcium sulfate sodium carbonate calcium carbonate sodium hydrogen carbonate and copper sulfate next we have a properties of salt salt exist in solid states they are formed in crystalline or in power uh, powder form they have high melting and boiling points generally salts are soluble in water however the salts like calcium carbonate lead chloride and calcium sulfate etc are insoluble in water aqueous solution of metal salts are their molten form conduct electricity many of the salts contain water molecules in their crystals which are responsible for the shape of the crystals carbonates and biocarbonates react with acids to liberate carbon dioxide gas when salts of heavy metals react with alkyl alkalis participates of heavy metal hydroxides are formed in the reaction mix mixture Mm, precipitates are the substance which appear as solid insoluble product in the liquid reaction mixture the chemical reaction of water with a salt produce, produce an acid and a base and the reaction is called hydrolysis next we have uses of salt a role of salt in human body salt of uh, salts of sodium potassium calcium magnesium and iron are needed for the normal working of our body they perform the following functions sodium and potassium salts are needed for the proper functioning of muscles and the nervous system salt in society in which we have food presentation photography so sodium chloride in industry fertilizer in agriculture food serving and medical uses salts b calcium are present in bones they are responsible for the strength of bones these salts are responsible for preventing heart attacks plasters of paris is used for broken lines potash alum alum is used to coagulate the blood coming out of a wound it is also used for the purification of water salts of iodine are needed for the proper functioning of thyroid glands they are also used for the treatment of goiter next we have uses of salt in our daily life in our daily life we use common salt for seasoning food it is also used as a preservative for fish and pickles a baking soda is used for giving softness to bread and cake washing soda is used for washing clothes and sodium potassium tartrate is used as a laxative next we have uses of salt in industry sodium chloride is used for the manufacture of chlorine hydrogen chloride caustic soda washing soda and sodium hydro hydrogen carbonate Sodium carbonate is used for softening hard water and for the manufacture of glass and soap. Potassium nitrate is used for the preparation of gunpowder and firework. It is also used as a fertilizer. Potash uh, potash alum is used for purification of water in dyeing cloth and for tanning hides. Copper sulfate is used as a fungicide in silico printing and in electro plating so today lecture is end 
I hope you understand my lecture. If you are new on my channel, then subscribe my channel and also hit the bell icon. Take, take care of yourself. Allah Hafiz.